Dothan City Schools will undergo a few improvements before starting classes next year. And this afternoon, the board met with contractors from around the Wiregrass. Tonight, our Sarah Drake joins us live to tell us what they talked about. Good evening, Sarah. Good evening, Paige. This afternoon, the Dothan City School Board held a luncheon with different Wiregrass contractors to show them different school improvement packages that they could bid on. Before opening up for the 2019 school year, a numerous amount of improvements will need to be made in a short amount of time to Dothan's public schools. Friday afternoon, the school board held a luncheon with different contractors to show what improvements need to be done. This was an opportunity for us to present our plans, how we're going to package the work, and then the timetable that we'll have to have these out for bid and for them to have an opportunity to give us their numbers as well. The board authorized the superintendent to engage in a $15 million bond issue to fund many of the improvements. Now the community can see the improvements uh, to these facilities. Ultimately, it's all about providing the best school facility that the kids can have a good learning environment. Brian tells me this has been a process, but he, along with the school board, are excited about these projects for the community. One package is just is just fully tied to Dothan Preparatory Academy. Another package is the new Dothan High School, the old Northview, and then the last package is a series of elementary schools. Brian tells me that most of the improvements will take place during the summer when the students are out on break. And Paige Prine tells me that they hope to have all the big renovations to the school done by August 3rd before the students return from summer break. Reporting live in Dothan, Sarah Drake, WDHN News 18. Back to you. Thank you, Sarah. With many homes across southeast Alabama,